catastrophic conditions facing hundreds of thousands of people in Gaza continue to get worse due to severe fuel shortages. Now, this condition is threatening access to food and other humanitarian supply operations to reach some of the world's most needy people at the current time. The United Nations World Food Program stressed that the people of Palestine need continuous aid delivery to ease suffering. Maria Macham has the details. Almost three weeks after the terror attack by Hamas militants against Israel sparked a wave of retaliatory airstrikes on the Gaza Strip, international humanitarian agencies are warning that the Palestinian territory is running out of critical and life-saving resources, especially fuel. The World Food Program representative in Palestine, Sama Abdel Jabbar, said the lack of fuel supply will affect the bakeries initiative by the organization to provide daily bread for the people. In Gaza, bakeries are struggling to meet their demand due to lack of fuels. Mills are not operating also because of lack of fuel. People are risking their lives and queuing for hours in the bakeries that are functioning to secure bread. Many of them are going home empty-handed. The concept of a hot meal in Gaza doesn't exist for the time being. The organization said fuel is not only critical for bakeries, but it is also needed for the trucks that receive the supplies entering through the Rafah crossing and distributing those supplies across Gaza. In addition, the organization said fuel is critical for hospitals and water desalination and pumping stations. The World Food Program rep also reiterated the United Nations Secretary General's call for a ceasefire. The bakeries contracted by WFP before the crisis were around 24. Today, there are only two operating and simply were not able to meet the demand of all the people that are residing in the shelters. Part of the operations of the World Food Program in Palestine include the assistance of close to 630,000 people in shelters and communities across Gaza and the West Bank. The assistance includes emergency food supplies, mainly canned food and fresh bread, and electronic vouchers where shops are open and have food supplies. Gaza, a narrow stretch of land along the Mediterranean Sea between Israel and Egypt, has been under an Israeli military bloc since Hamas took control of the enclave in 2007. Home to a densely packed population of about 2.3 million people, Gaza depends largely on Israel for drinking water, food supplies, electricity and fuel for its only power plant. Reporting for iAfrica News, I am Maria Macham.